WTOK TV takes its community service projects to heart. The team looks for ways to make lives better, to enhance the quality of life here in the Queen City and in the two state region. The station looks for opportunities to sponsor community wide projects or even organize an event to collect toys for children at Christmas. When disaster strikes, it's WTOK who sets the gold standard in community involvement. We want this to be an amazing place to live, and we're going to do anything we can to make that happen. Hurricane Katrina hit Mississippi in August of 2005. That Category 3 storm blew inland and destroyed property in Meridian. It knocked out power and communications with the outside world. Tim Walker was in his first year as a general manager at WTOK TV. He says the devastation was unexpected and it traumatized many. Operating the station in the aftermath after the storm was over was probably one of the more humbling things that we ever did. We turned the lobby of the station into almost like a public library. We had computers set up where people who were here as evacuees and had no means of communicating back home or didn't know what was going home could come here to the station and use those facilities to find out what was happening at home, some of them finding out if they had a home, some of them finding out if they had loved ones. It was gut-wrenching. Sort of WTOK TV launched Toython in 1990 as a way to gather toys for the Wesley House. Over 23 years, the Toython campaign has grown into a citywide event, collecting thousands of dollars in toys for five charities. The entire staff volunteers to staff trucks and collect toys for families in the region. COVID-19 negatively impacted families in 2020 as people struggled to put food on the table and pay bills. The station discovered local food banks needed donations. The TV station partnered with Piggly Wiggly to collect food to alleviate food insecurities over the holidays. After three years, WTOK collects thousands of dollars in donations and food items to help charities like the Salvation Army and Love's Kitchen. I think WTOK is successful in this community because we care about the community. We want to find a way to make life better. WTOK looks for community partnership opportunities. The station partners with groups like the State Games of Mississippi, the City of Meridian, United Way, schools, and charities. Coats for Kids has been a project that WTOK, partnering with Meridian Mutual Federal Credit Union, has embraced for 35 years. Coats are collected by the public and brought to WTOK for children in need of a warm coat in the winter. These coats are then distributed by the Wesley House to needy children throughout the region. WTOK was one of the first television stations to broadcast in the state of Mississippi. That is 70 years of news, weather, and sports. Next, we stop and reflect on the news that is making history in the region and what stories changed our legacy forever. Thank you to all of you. Happy birthday, WTOK. Wishing you many, many more. From all of us at General Hospital. Happy 70th anniversary to WTOK TV.